Hello families, for the next two weeks you will see that we are learning all about digraphs, that is two letters that work together to make one sound, so letters like WH say W, SH says SH, CH, TH, or V. So those are examples of digraphs. And the first digraph your child probably already learned was QU, qua, qua. So we are going to focus on two letters making one new sound for the next couple of weeks. In addition, we will be learning about life cycles of animals. Again, life cycles of animals. And we're going to focus on four different animals for our life cycle learning. We're going to learn about the life cycle of butterflies, frogs, chickens, and sea turtles. So I know children are going to really enjoy learning about these life cycles with both myself and their learning coach. Now, you will see that this Thursday, we do not have any meet sessions, not for story, not show and tell, and not our morning meet sessions. And that is because I need everyone to click here and sign up for a time for your child to be tested. This is state mandated testing. It will be our last state mandated testing for the year. And students will be given Ames Web assessments and possibly a third assessment, depending on how they score on the two Ames Web ass assessments. So please be sure to arrive on time, not early, not late, just on time, please, um, as most students will probably take the full amount of time for this assessment. Um, lastly, uh, you will notice that we have a second week on this calendar, just like we did before. So this calendar lasts for two weeks. Um, we have normal meet sessions for the week of the 17th, but please know that the following week will be report card assessments. So this week is regular, but the first week, the 10th, we'll do, be doing benchmark assessment. And then the next week, which will be May 24th, please prepare yourself to know that we will be doing report card assessments. I hope you have a wonderful couple of weeks of learning and keep up the great work learning coaches. You're almost there. Great job, boys and girls.